He's living his life, but don't tell him. He's living his life, but don't budge him. Now then, guys, today we're here at Weatherspoons, yeah? And all Weatherspoons in the country are offering unlimited hot chocolate for 99 pence, right? And I'm here with TikTok Tommy, right, yeah? Who says he can drink as much hot chocolate, right, yeah, as I can throw at him. How much do you think you can do, Tommy? 12. 12? I'm going to push it further than 12. Uh, two hot chocolates, yeah. They're the free refill ones, aren't they? Yeah, yeah please, yeah. 198. Yeah. That seems to be better with hot chocolate. This one round corner is not too good sometimes. I'm ready for hot chocolate, right? Yeah, yeah. Right, so is this hot chocolate number one? As you like to say, beautiful. <laughs> Be beautiful, Tommy, isn't it? Beautiful. I think that's a good deal for a hot chocolate, 99p. Can't argue, can you? It's more in Greg's or anywhere like that. Smells alright. Uh, let me get one. Right, hot chocolate, let's have a look. Where are we? Hot chocolate. There we go. Oh, look at that, beautiful. So here they are, here's the hot chocolates. One's got more in than the other, but um, yeah, they look alright to be fair, you know what I mean? I guess it's about how they taste rather than how they look in it, so what do you think Tommy on first impressions? Looks alright, don't it? Looks, don't look cheap stuff, for 99p you can't argue. Tommy, here's to cup number one. Right Tommy, what do you think? It's not very, I've got a mocha, it's not very chocolatey, it's alright, you know what I mean, but... you got a what? A mocha. A mocha's not a lot of chocolate, is it? So, give me any option. Oh, but you, so you choose a mocha? I want a mocha for That's a coffee, option. isn't it? Uh, coffee mocha, coffee chocolate. <laughs> oh, I didn't know he'd gone rogue with, with options, like, I thought he'd just go for a hot chocolate. That's why Tommy's looked different, because he'd gone for a mocha. I didn't know that. So that's a coffee hot chocolate. So how are you getting on with your first cup, Tommy? Nearly through it. Doing all right. I am not. I'm going to tell you something here, right, yeah, which you're probably all going to find a bit weird. I don't like hot chocolate. <laughs> I'm only doing this, right, because I did the alcoholic drinks the other day and somebody said to me, can you get non-alcoholic drinks? What What's the best deal you can find? So I thought unlimited hot chocolate, mockers, teas, coffees for 99p is going to be hard to beat. So you've got a proper hot chocolate this time. Oh, what do you think? All right. Yeah. It's not very chocolatey, but it's... did you prefer the mocha? I prefer the mocha personally. But it's still nicer. So it's... you you think realistically, right? That's your second cup now, Tommy. Right? Yeah. So it cost you a pound, but you now have two cups. So now they're working out at fifty pence a cup. So yeah. Think of it like that, yeah. Right. So next time you get a cup, they're working out at thirty-three p a <laughs> cup. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Right, so when you think of it like that, is that worth 50p? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, it's worth right. 50p easily. Life on a budget there. <laughs> well, that, I didn't even know it did this. So you can get some Viennese fingers for 40p. I think we've got to get in on some of them, Tommy, haven't we? Yeah. So I've got my second cup. I've got a fresh cup like you're going to do every time. Looks like I'm probably going to be a regular at this bar because even though I don't like hot chocolate, the first one went down all right. How are you getting on with that one, Tommy? Halfway through. Halfway through. Out to report. It's 50p a drink at the moment. <laughs> Beautiful. It's going to be 33p in a minute, mate. <laughs> that looks better than the last one, if I'm honest with you. Do you know what? They're not that bad, actually. They're all right, aren't they? I'm happy with it. Yeah, for it costs. I'll definitely get it again. Show you me a little Viennese biscuit. Well, it's not a dipping biscuit. What? What do you mean? Like you've got your rich things, your old dipping biscuit. I would recommend that as a dipping biscuit. Give it a go. Alright. Is it? Not chocolate, it's not a dipping drink, though, is it? Either. Dipping it, so you don't soak it up much. Oh. <laughs> if you want the little biscuit to go with your unlimited hot chocolate, 
For what it be? Well, that nice biscuit actually, isn't that? Yeah, nice biscuit, so. Yeah, really nice. So Tommy had an idea on how to improve these hot chocolates, literally for a pound. So I crossed over the road to the Arndale Shopping Centre and I found what we needed. But first, I just want to show you this. Just to show you how cheap Weatherspoons is, I've just nipped down to Iceland to grab some, which you'll see in a sec. I just looked at this, right, yeah, and it's 300 grams, £2.50, right, and it takes 28 grams to make a hot chocolate. So you get 10 hot chocolates out of that, but that doesn't include your milk, your cup, your washing up. So, you know, they're working out at 25 pence a cup if you get 10 out of it, if you use the recommended. So, that is just showing you how good a deal this is at Weber Spoons. Tommy suggested that a few improvements could be made, and as I'm not a hot chocolate drinker, right, I can only go with what he suggests. So, we've been to Iceland, We've been and got some squirty cream. I don't think it's going to work. But... Oh, it is an improvement, isn't it? It is an improvement. Yeah, it is an improvement, you know. Oh, that's all right, though, isn't it? <laughs> I might suggest this to Weatherspoons, charge a bit more. And I mean, Tommy's on his fourth cup now, I'm on my third, so in theory, that's costing Tommy 25p. I know we've bought the cream, but to be honest with you, it does improve it. But what I don't understand is that, you know, a coffee shop, to make one that we've just made that looks really nice with cream on top, they charge you, what, 2 50 3 quid? Yeah. You know. Some places are more costly. Yeah. You know, we've made this into kind of a gourmet hot chocolate. It's costing us what an extra 5p a cup, maybe. So, this is my third cup, and to say I don't even like hot chocolate, the cream has made a big improvement. I'm surprised, really. You know, I do understand now why places bang a lot of cream on top of hot chocolate. I think mean, it's made a good improvement. And you know, places like Weatherspoons they are busy, so it looks like the world has returned back to normal. You know, I know a lot of places were dead with COVID and that, but not in Weatherspoons, mate. These folk are afraid to get out and get some bargains, are they? I saw somewhere that you can get a beer for 99p in here, but I don't know if it's true. I've seen that. You have? Yeah. Is it true? So, we've just been speaking to somebody. Until the end of Feb, you can get a whiskey, an ale or a Bex for 99p. That's, I think that's crazy, me. And you can get more than one. Yeah, so it's not limited to one per customer. So you can literally come in here, and if you wanted a drink, you could you could go mad with eight quid, really. The guy just told us, as well, if you drink and dry a bet, so you're thinking, right, these places might only have seven bottles in, you know, and then they'll just tell you you've run out. Not here. They'll replace it with either, the, the bet runs out, they'll replace it with a Sol, Estrella. Mate, Good, isn't it? it's a bargain. I think we're doing the wrong drinking challenge. Yeah, you know what I mean? <laughs> I think it's time for another video. Imagine if you're just going to meet a friend, you want to catch up for a few hours, you don't want to do it at your house. You could see here for two, three hours drinking teas, coffee, hot chocolates. You could be on Tinder and not want to spend a lot, so you take a bit of hot chocolate. Hey, it's Valentine's Day coming up, that. Perfect. What an idea, do you know what I mean? <laughs> Bring them here, 99p. So. If you're looking for a, so if you ladies out there are looking for a nice date, you know Tommy will bring you for a hot chocolate with his bills, you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm so enjoying it as well, next time it's 20p a cup. I mean, I mean, throw 40p in, in Valentine's Day, you have got a pack of biscuits as well. <laughs> oh, look at them, beautiful. <laughs> are we going for the upgrade, Tommy? Look serious that guys, look at that, and there's Tommy's. These these are these are four quid drinks these elsewhere. Twenty p a drink, you know, we've been here what an hour and a half enjoying ourselves. 
you know, staff, staff. I've got to say, staff are really good. They've been really nice, haven't they, Tommy? Yeah, yeah, it's been been nice. Enjoyed yeah. it. Good staff, you know. Good drinks. Yeah, nice. Can't knock it. I mean, we could do with some marshmallows at some point, but <laughs> we'll do with what we've got. I'll finish this in a second. One second. I'm struggling now. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> what what cup are you on? Uh, I'm on twenty p. So I'll be getting my six. Six. Right, Tommy. Do you fancy another hot chocolate? No, not to, to be honest with you. I've had enough. I'm fancy a, fancy a ninety nine p max. Oh, it sounds a good idea to me, Tommy. <laughs> Let's do it. Ninety nine p. Cheers, Tommy. So. He just beat at a bar. He's got Bex, 99 pence right here. The hot chocolates were good, but to be honest with you, I've had five. Tommy's drunk six, and it's we're gonna struggle to drink anymore if I'm honest with you. It's, what do you think, Tommy? I'm, I'm happy with Bex. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, look, the hot chocolates were good. It's a good deal. You know, remember it's coffees, lattes, mochas. Cappuccinos. What was that thing you got first, Tommy? I got a mocha first, but like you had a few drinks and a caught up and stuff, and it just shows you have done it for 99 p each. Hot chocolate, speaking for a few hours. Next minute, we've both got a bex each. Just, yeah. You know what I mean? It's going well. I mean, look, we spent under a fiver. We've had several drinks. Now we're having a couple of beers. Biscuits. Biscuits. <laughs> we upgraded the hot chocolate with a cream on. You know, it's you know, and you can't knock. You know, this is a, a Bex is a premium beer. So to be honest with you, I know Weatherspoons gets a bit of a bad reputation, but you know you can't knock it. You know, people say this out over about. I see people weighing chips and stuff. You know, I don't really want to go that far, but you know, when you, you've not seen people weighing chips. It's a big thing in Weatherspoons. <laughs> people weigh the chips. Oh, wow. Yeah, have you not seen it? It's a big thing. People weigh chips, but. You are with who you're coming here with, you know. Some people say they don't like the atmosphere. Well, you know, you've got these lovely little boobs all over. Seeing one of them with the right company, you pay 99p for a bet. So, right, guys, if you like this content, remember to like, subscribe, do what you can. And remember, Tommy on TikTok, Tom Win Stanley, follow him. He's got thousands of followers. He smashes duets out, smashes loads of little silly videos just to put a smile on your face. So go check Tommy out as well. Great lad. You might not like him. Like, subscribe. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs>